All right, so every time you start your old Mercedes, you get this warning on the dash, all right? That is not a failure. That's basically telling you that the tele-aid or the embrace is not connected. It's just letting you know, all right? So what we're gonna do is we're gonna code it out. By coding it out, it means we're going to tell the instrument cluster module that it is not installed in the vehicle, so you will no longer see that message. I'm gonna be using my Top Don Phoenix Plus to do this. And what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna switch over to the screen recording so that way you guys can see the process and I will narrate it from there. In any scanner, the first thing you're gonna to have to do is pick the Mercedes-Benz software. Then you're gonna to have to determine the vehicle. This car is too old for automatic VIN detection. So I just picked the SL of the early 2003 era. And instead of doing the control unit health report, I end up manually selecting the control module. So first I do left hand steering, then I do the model, then I do control units, then information and communication, then instrument cluster. All right, it always makes you be sure the ignition is on. Then I go to variant coding and I picked VCD000. Uh, it may display differently on your scanner, but then I scroll down to the emergency, emergency call system. When you select that, it'll give you the option to set it as present or not present. All I did was change it to not present. Then press OK. It always writes the coding uh, after you select write coding. It'll save it basically. You press yes. It always makes you wait and then turn the ignition off so it can accept it. Depending on the car, it may say 10 seconds, may say 3 seconds. Once it does its reset, gives you the confirmation that I can exit out and we're done. Simple as that. As long as you have the right scanner, anyone can do this. All right, so now that the coding is done, I can turn the key on and no more warning for the SOS. All right. If the SOS failed, you're gonna to have to do a fiber optic bypass to the audio system. I will not cover that in this video. I may cover it in another video, but basically you're either going to tell the instrument cluster or the central gateway module that the tele-aid or the emergency call system is not installed. And that should take care of your issue. I hope this helps.